Sure. Since you decided to post yeah. my personal information on the internet, uh -huh. take it down, please. No. I ask you nicely. And you can ask me however you want, but when you come around and start destroying our property, do you think, do you think Carlos, do you think that's going to, um, Carlos, look, man. <laughs> Carlos, are you being sinless now? Are you being patient now, Carlos? Because if not, you will die in hell. Call 911. Go ahead. That is where you are headed, Carlos. So you don't get your way? You're going to throw a tantrum? Unfortunately, Carlos, your heart shows what is in it. Is this sinless perfectionist, Carlos? If you get your way, then you don't sin. But if you get your way, if you get your way, you don't sin. Is this justifiable sin, Carlos? Carlos, you know this goes up right next to the other videos. Right? <laughs> Thank you, Carlos. Hey, have a good day, man. I'll pray for you, man. Here, you put those, just put your sign down, put those up, and I'll follow them. Hey, Matt, just put those up. Carlos, you know, do you know why we do this? We try to show the hearts of men who profess to be Christians. We show their hearts. They care more about pictures being up than actually babies being murdered. I'm judging God's church and you're out of line. I'm judging you right now because of the fruit of your deeds. Do you think you're more committed to knocking down the signs than I am to setting them back up again? Is this the first time you've ever opposed something, Carlos? Is this the first time, Carlos? Is this what it takes to get you to oppose something? Huh? Carlos, you can't knock them down fast enough, man. All you're showing is a hatred in your heart. Carlos, it doesn't get better, it gets worse, brother. Your deeds prove you out. There's no such thing and you're proof of it, of sinless perfectionists, Carlos. There you go, Carlos. Again, showing the fruit of what is in your heart. You need to repent, brother, because if not, you will die in hell. Because that is where you are headed, Carlos. You are headed to hell. Unfortunately, Carlos, your heart shows what is in it. Your heart shows the evil that is in it, Carlos. Yeah, he's standing right there, back door, with the gray shirt, gray jacket. What did he do jacket. He threw all our stuff in the street. Two weeks ago, he threw them all down that sewer. We were able to get most of it out of the sewer. All right, let me go talk to him. Okay, oh, see, they're bringing him in, getting him away from you like they did two weeks ago. That's the guy that we had a case open against a few weeks back for throwing our signs in the sewer, which are still in the sewer. One of them, we couldn't get one out. Well, I got a chance to speak uh, with Carlos. Uh-huh. Uh, and told him, you know, it's no different than if he was standing out on the public property and he had his gym bag sitting on the ground and you didn't like the color of his gym bag and you came up and tossed it. You yeah. know, you wouldn't appreciate your gym bag being right. tossed, you know, right. into the sewer or into the street. Yeah. So, you know, they don't, even though it's a sign, it's their sign. 
Yeah. You know, so they don't appreciate their signs being thrown or something like that. So right. there's another deacon that was in sign that also made an announcement to not engage with you all um, and to you know let you all exercise your right as far as right. speech. So yeah. he's made aware. Yeah. Uh, and I told Carlos that. So and the, like I said, the deacon inside also is aware. Yeah. Because he made the announcement. So okay. not only Carlos is aware now, but every other person inside <laughs> is aware. Yeah. That they should not engage with you all and do things like yeah. what Carlos decided to do. 